the 17th, 467 yards par four for many, perhaps the toughest hole on the course. The problem here is it dog legs left, and if your tee shot isn't far enough right, you won't be able to see the green. And then it becomes a matter of you and your caddy picking out the lines if you've gone left, where are you trying to hit it towards? Is there a house in the horizon? Is there a tree? You've got to know exactly where you're trying to hit that second shot if you can't see the green. The other problem here is in the driving zone for the pros, particularly today, it's downwind. Um, the fairway narrows dramatically just after the bunkers and uh, you're really trying to thread it through the eye of a needle at the far end of the fairway here. So what do you do? Lay back, leave yourself a tougher shot or attack and try and get a good view of the green. This is where my ball has come to rest. I think you can just see the flag there in the frame. I thought I'd hit a pretty good tee shot. It's gone about 265 according to the yardage book. Um, and I can only just see the top of the flag and I've just missed the fairway as well uh, by a fraction. Now obviously the top guys are gonna be a lot longer than me, especially downwind as it is today. Their problem though is that the further they go, the more these bunkers either side of the fairway come into play and then there's that narrowing of the fairway that I talked about where you're hitting into a much smaller target. So what do you do? Do you lay back to somewhere like this, pick a line, try and execute, or do you try and go a little bit further, give yourself a better view of the flag, but perhaps risk running into one of these bunkers if you just overdo it? I'm going to try the approach shot now, trusting in faith. Well, I can't hit it much better than that, so I'll be very interested to get up there and see exactly where that is. There's a very fine margin between success and failure, isn't there? I've come over here full of anticipation, full of hope, but my ball has actually just run through the green, down this little slope, and onto a down slope here, going back up. I've now got to pitch it up onto the top and hope that I can get it somewhere close. It's only about eight yards away, but a very tricky shot. Uh, in the Open Championship itself, probably the crowd sound would have told me exactly what had happened to my ball. First, perhaps a ripple of applause, and then a bit of a groan as the ball rolls on through and the crowd know that you now face a tricky shot. Uh, well, I'll give it a go. Can't guarantee success here. <laughs> there you go. Trying to just get underneath it, but on the downslope, too tricky. I've knifed it, and now from coming over here thinking maybe birdie chance, I've now got a 35-footer to save par. <laughs> 